I'm sorry. Hey guys, eball me here. Um, I'm getting everything set up for Pete so we can do his video. I haven't seen him in a while, so I figure I come all the way down from Minnesota, and the fucking phone's ringing. Hey guys, eball me here. Sorry, I had to answer Pete's phone. Pete's gonna show you all his talent grips on his guns. I wanted talent grips for my high point, but they refused to make them for it. That's me. Eve me. Uh, as you as you know, as you've seen on my uh, Facebook page, uh, I used to I never was in the Facebook when I first was told that I should make a Facebook page. I'm like Facebook's for girls, ain't it? But I was way wrong about that. It's a great way to uh, just branch your channel out and uh, get more people involved. And uh, as far as Facebook goes, I need to um, mention a very important channel. Uh, which I forgot to do in the last video. I put the link under there, but I didn't. I didn't remember to. Me I didn't remember to mention it because it's really important. Howard from the bunker really works hard on fighting for gun rights. He actually sits down and goes face to face with these people, and he's constantly exposing things that are going wrong that that shouldn't be going on, and uh, exposes these people, especially something else he's doing which I believe in now I'm not gonna say I don't buy nothing from China I'd be a hypocrite if I did that but if something's made in China and they're stamping USA on it just to get it sold just to sell it to Americans and it's really not uh, to me that's terrible that's just as bad as the American flag being made not in America which is ridiculous so his channel is really helping us us gun people in the gun community and he's probably the, the most stand-up guy I ever met in my life so I'm going to put his link under the video right under here his Facebook link I'd really appreciate it if you guys went over there and uh, friended him I don't know how he has it set up some people send it up set it up like to like it and some people have to send it up where you have to friend and set a send a request I think the best way to set it up is to set it up like a like page but I'm too late for me. I can't. I already set it up. I set it up like an idiot. But I don't know how Howard's is set up. I think his is like mine too. You got to friend them. But it's great. Every time you go over there, you find out facts and good information and what's going on. Uh, you know, in the in the gun world, it's it's, it's awesome. Not only the gun world, the, the honest world, and the dishonest world. All right. So thank you for that. I appreciate that. Believe me, you'll thank me for going over there. You'll find out. He'll keep you updated on everything. All kinds of stuff you would love to know what's going on. And he's not an extremist. He's just a guy with common sense that's smart. So, believe me, I wouldn't mention it if I thought he was, uh, you know, an extremist, crazy person. He's not. And he's got a uh, very uh, successful business for uh, gun accessories and all kinds of tactical equipment. But I'm sure that link's over there, too. It's called The Bunker. I've been Howard's friend for years. Okay, um, I just wanted to show you some of my Glocks that now have the Talon grips on them, which I think should have them on them. Ever since I put Talon grips on my Glock 19, my group improved immediately. Usually when I shoot a gun, I get kind of get worked up, my heart rate gets going, causes, uh, what do you call that? I can't, it causes you to sweat. So your palms get clammy right away, uh, and these talent grips pretty much almost take that out of the equation immediately. And you're just like on target, man. So after that happened, I'm like, well, the guns that need these talent grips even more so than a full-size gun are these little guns. This will give you an idea how small a Glock 42 is. This Glock 19 is a medium-sized gun. 
Okay, now this Smith and Smith and Wesson Shield nine millimeter is a small gun, not really a pocket gun. Could be for some people, but then you have the Glock 42, which is even I know from that camera angle it doesn't look smaller. It's just it's it's more it's it's smaller. Believe me. This way it's more petite. It's very it's lighter. It's 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 just really little. Just wanted to show you the comparison how, how little this 42 is, and the talon grips work work great on the little guns. If you ever had trouble staying bullseye with a little gun, try to put on the the rubber talon grips. Uh, it will improve your shooting big time. And we now sell them at Double Action for almost every gun. We got tons of them, and uh, people have been coming up left and right. Picking them up for their gun, they're real happy. For, real happy uh, with them. And uh, if you can't put them on, if you don't want to put them on, we'll do it for you. All right. All right. So uh, this Glock 19 right now is probably the most reliable, dependable, best shooting gun uh, I'm experiencing right now. I'm just having a lot of fun with this Glock 19. It's such a joy to shoot, and never no, never no issues, never no problems. We're like over 1,200 rounds, and it just keeps on rocking and rolling, and staying in the bullseye. And phew, I just love this gun, man. You know, when a gun performs for you like that, it just increases your love for it. You know, what a what a fantastic firearm. So that's great. Uh, the Smith and Wesson Shield. I haven't been shooting it lately, but you know, so far it's been fantastic, easy to shoot accurately. Now with the talon grips, I can't wait to shoot it again to see how much better I can shoot it now. Because I am a sweaty, clammy son of a bitch. You know, when I was little, I'm fat now, but when I was little, I always had a fantasy of becoming a Navy SEAL. Now I'm a Gravy SEAL. That's about as far as I got. I just want to show a couple things that uh, people sent me for my birthday. I just want to show them how grateful I am. Not Everything's not here. Uh, if you don't see something, don't get all ass hurt. I just have a bad memory. Uh, first guy I want to thank is, um, is uh, Tom, uh, Midway Shooter. Uh, I got your card, Tom. Thank you very much. Thanks for the donation for the channel. I, I appreciate it. It's awesome. Thanks for the card, most of all. Mr. 45 Bullet got me, sent me this great movie with uh, Jason State, Staten, I can't say his name. This movie's fantastic, it's called Homefront, and he, he sent it to me on Blu-ray and DVD. They're both in there. Thanks, Bill. That's one of the things Bill, Bill sent me. He sent me a few things. He also sent me Out of the Furnace. Very good movie. If you guys haven't seen that, I enjoyed it awesome movie so these two movies are very good if you haven't seen them a lot of cool guns in them a lot of cool guns in them most importantly and mr. 45 bullet also sent me I have the complete seasons of all the Sopranos because to me greatest TV series of all time I don't care what you say there's nothing like it and uh, if you've never seen them, start it. Just just get season one and just watch one CD at a time, one episode at a time. It'll just suck you in like a vacuum cleaner. You'll love it. Uh, this was I was missing this. I was missing season six, part one. There's there's two parts of season six. I was missing part one, and Bill was nice enough to uh, send me the complete season of part one of season six. Thanks, Bill. I know uh, that's not cheap. That's that's pretty generous of you. Thank you very much. And my wife got me from Amazon for my birthday one of my favorite World War II pictures with my favorite male vocalist Mr. Francis Albert Sinatra. As you know I'm a huge Sinatra fan and I mean who else can you like listen to their music to their you know your favorite singer and then watch them make movies with Oscar performance acting. I mean, nobody else has done that but him. He's the only one. I mean, there's nobody, nobody's done that. You know? And this, this is a classic. It's called Von Ryan's Express. I know a lot of you young guys 
probably heard of it and probably never seen it. But this is an excellent World War II. I'm really not a, you know, an old old movie buff, but you know, he's my one of my favorite uh, recording artists. So this, which get, made me give this a chance to watch. I watched it from the beginning all the way to the end. Even my 16-year-old uh, son watched it from beginning all the way to the end. It's just a classic war picture. It's about the, the Nazis in a, a prison camp, and uh, it's about a, like a great escape is what it's about. Fantastic movie, classic. So I want to thank my wife for that. And my man Joe from Double Action, he's a customer, uh, got me one of these. This thing is neat. It's called the Rock. It's made by Rockford. It's called the Pocket Power Jump Jump Starter. This thing is unreal. Now I'm showing it because this relates to preppers and guns and all that. This thing is great for an emergency. Look how small it is. It's about the size. It's smaller than a videotape. Here's a DVD next to it. Look, it's smaller than a DVD, this thing. And once you charge it, it's charged for a whole year. You don't have to worry about it. This, how small this is. This will jump motorcycles, boats, a regular size car, a big size car, all the way up to a commercial trash truck more than 13 times on one charge. Really? Look how small this is. Um, if I, I don't, I'm not sure what this company is. If I can find them on the internet, I'll put the link below. So you guys might want to get one for yourself if I can find it. But uh, I don't know how much they are. It was a gift for my birthday, so thank you, Joe, for this. But this will jump a car. It has 400 cranking amps, and that's amazing. These are the little jumper cables you get with it. But the whole thing is once you jump your car with it, you have to unplug it within 30 seconds because the feedback can damage the battery pack. That is a great thing. And now it has all these, you know, um, cell phone, your laptop, iPads, has all the adapters so you can charge on that too, also. That is friggin' incredible. That is incredible that this little thing can jump a, a, a car. Unreal. There is YouTube videos on it, people doing it, and there's reviews on it, and it's five stars. So it's not exaggerated, it is what it is. So thank you, Joey. Joey Meatballs. We call him Joey Meatballs because his mom's like one of the best cooks in uh, Delaware County, and they bring us homemade Italian food up once in a while. Now, back to uh, another uh, package I got from uh, Mr. Um, one of my very very close friends on YouTube. He's been my friend for since I started. Mr. Eric Bomi E. Bomi. There's a birthday card. Okay, looks like an, a used card. Guess he couldn't afford to get me a new one. Happy birthday, Pete. Okay. Wishing you, well, it says sunshine, but he crossed it out and put moonshine. And, uh, and bullets on your special day. And it says love Pam and Monty. He scratched all that out because uh, he's cheap, you know. Very funny, Eric. And what else did Eric Bonney got me? I uh, see. A nice t-shirt. Oh, it looks too small. Wow, really? Should I throw up now, dude? Are you kidding me? I will hang this in the background in your honor, Eric. That is the Minnesota Wild NHL hockey team. Okay? Thank you, buddy. Whatever. Jesus, God. Okay. Well... I don't know, it might be a good jizz rag someday. Uh, Eric, you're, you are phenomenal. Don't say 2XL, but I'm saying it's going to be too small. But If I dare to wear this in, in Philadelphia, I will get my ass kicked. Minnesota Wild NHL t-shirt. Oh my god, what else did he get? Very nice to see what's in here. You never know what Eric's going to send you. Okay. Little old man condom. It says it says your birthday. Very nice. Tweezers, magnifying glass not included. Very nice, Eric. These are my good friends. Okay. Now this is something I will use. It's a gun and it's a bottle opener. That's pretty cool. 
Actually, Eric, believe it or not, I, I do need a bottle opener because the beer I've been buying lately are not twists off. Thank you for that. Is that a high point? That might be a real high point. Probably is. They just welded the slide shut. Made a friggin' bottle opener out of it. Okay, and what else do we got here? Here's my Facebook page. Hello, my name is Old. A Packer Erector. That's, far, that's real funny, Eric. Stay hard, stay happy, great wood guaranteed. Wonderful. Okay, and wow, he did rather get me something nice. All the jokes aside, look at that. Philadelphia Flyers, Zamboni. I said that right? What that does is uh, that resurfaces the ice in between periods. That is really cool. I will love that. I'll put that on my uh, sports memorabilia shelf that I have in my living room that my wife hates. And uh, that is really nice. I like that. Thank you, Eric, and thank you, Miss Bomey. Bam. Well, that's it, guys. I hope you liked the video. It's just a uh, bullshit video, friendship video, package video. And uh, we'll definitely be doing uh, more shooting. Uh, I want to get the Ed Brown out. I got something really beautiful ordered. It should be here in about two days. Wait till you see this. Uh, I've had I've sent another gun out to be repaired. You ain't gonna believe what gun when I tell you. You ain't gonna believe it, but um, if they fix it right, I'm fine with it. All right, guys, I will update. I will update you on all that stuff. I'll talk to you guys soon.